we're back. Which means it's time for a down to the dad joke. Get ready. It's going to be awesome. Uh, let's see. Which one are we going with? Oh, we got to go with this one. My son already liked this one. What kind of keys are easy to swallow? <clears throat> Cookies. <laughs> that stuff's good. I don't care who you are. So we're back with that pickup. We did paint it. Uh, painted it red because this guy right here, you know, here, has a 2017 red F-150. This is an F-350 Super Duty. And we tuned the supercharged engine, and holy cow, look at the measured horsepower on this thing. 1,963 horsepower and 1,768 pound-feet of torque. It is a beast. Holy cow. So we're going to see how this performs on the drag strip in the quarter mile. I have no idea. Uh, I looked slightly at the gears. I haven't made any adjustments from where it came to. Um, so we're just going to, we're just going to drive it, see what happens. Uh, we'll do a few test runs and then, uh, come back, adjust on the gears as we need and make our determinations where we go from there. It's got leather. Nice. All right. Where are we going? To the drag strip. Let's do a warm-up and practice quarter mile. Just a test on the gears here. See how she does. Alright, those gears are all kinds of wrong. So we started with a 10.3 at 150. That is not going to cut it. I think to compete at that level, it's, I mean, it's a heavy beast. So who knows how well she's going to do. But I'd still like to get at least through one, one or two rounds with this sucker. It's got so much power. It's unbelievable. So probably 155 if we get the gears right. A 411 rear end is what it already had, so we'll stick with that. Uh, this gear seemed way wrong. 25. Make this a point higher. There we go. I always should somehow shoot for five gears in the quarter. At least that's what I've been doing. One fifty five. I got over a one gear here. That curve looks okay, right? Looks smooth, at least. All right, let's hop back in the truck. Take her over to the drag. Do one more test run, see how it feels, and then we'll try King of the Sands. I almost wanted to just hop right in. Almost a flat 10 at 153. Let's try it. Just see how King of the Sands goes. 
If we're way off performance-wise, we're way too far away, we'll we'll make adjustments. Yep, we'll play. And same thing with the bats. We'll just bat the car with the highest rating. See how this goes. Right, we got to win. Um. I can't argue that. Okay. Let's uh, write down our time. Quarter mile for the pickup. Quarter mile time was 10. What, 175 at 153, right? Yeah. Save that. Move the spreadsheet. <laughs> Do some bets. Seven fifty. Huh, 747 versus 747. Now we'll go for the Ferrari. 756. Two losses, dang. So you bet the ratings and you lose. You bet which car you think would win, you lose. This car's got us. Yep. That's what I figured. We'd have to run in the nines. We were close that time. That was better. That was a 10.002 at 150. I don't think I should have done that shift in the six at the end day there either. Okay, I think, yep. Let's do one more adjustment to gears just to see if we can make a little bit more out of this. Because my first gear is uh, I'm shifting you know, way too early on the first gear. So I can make that, we can move everything up just a smidge, I think. Let's make a, like a five adjustment across the board. A little bit more. Just move everything just a shade up. That was at 7.5, right? Go for a full point. Oops. Try that. One more run. If we can get it, good deal. Sometimes it's just getting it just right or just adapting it to the way you're shifting. Now you could probably go even with less gears, honestly. Or more. Not even going to test. We're going straight to the king.
All right, let's see how we do. Yeah, we got three wins right there. That's not bad. Three wins, one loss on this on that. Oh, I red line right off the bat. Are you kidding me? That was. Did you see that? It was not good. No, I red lined. No one saw it. No one saw that. We're fine. Oh, we did good on the bets there, man. We only lost two bets. See, I think we're going in cabin this time. The shift point on this seems to be just past that red line. Oh, there we go. We got in the nines. Ah. I think if we roll in the nines, we, we could do it. And that was just a small tweak at those gear ratios. 9.902 .9 at 154. So that's a little bit better than what we did last time. So maybe we got it with the pickup. I, I mean, a F-350 Super Duty taking on a Porsche? Why not, right? If you're rolling with like 1,768 pound-feet of torque, then you can run against a Porsche. That car seems close. Couldn't see it. Oh, it wasn't that close. Forgot to bet last round. Break gas. Shifts were the best as I could do. Did we get it? Whew. Nine nine to a nine eight nine eight. Holy cow. That was close. But it's actually a better time. Nine point eight nine eight at one fifty four. Wow, that was close. I was gonna say you could hear it the I got the sound in the ear here. Man, that car you could just hear he was close. Alright. What are we going up against? The Ferrari. It is ranked higher than us. Cross your fingers, folks. See if the F-350 can win a drag race King of the Sand style. Going from behind the truck this time. I think we got him. I think we got him. Unless he pulled right at the end. Ah, we had him. We had him handedly. A 9952. Nine, nine, crushed him. That poor stick came really close to killing us. We got a King of the Sands win with a 2017 Ford 350 Super Duty with a supercharged engine and uh, 1,963 horsepower and 1,768 pound-feet of torque. So, I mean, that might have had something to do with it. You know, that's what I'm saying. Just you know, a little bit. King of the Sands win? Heck yes. That was awesome. Let's save that. So that was the 27... 2017 uh, F-350 Super Duty. That was bad. That was bad. 
really good. So we'll have to pick up our next car here. Um, we got to go shopping for cars. Let's see. So this car is done. So if I can, hey bub. Oh yeah, we're back on the spreadsheet, bud. We're crushing the spreadsheet. We just did a 2017 F uh, 350. Welcome to the stream, by the hey, way. Chat, this is my boy. Chat, chat. This is my boy. I just finished my homework. Yeah. Good job. I did, this I truck. Did extra chapter this truck won the King of the Sands. Crazy. Anyway, now we're gonna pick out the next car. Well, you're here. You're a guest speaker. Um, you get to pick out my next car. Chat, chat, chat. Owned oh, zero views. Let's see. That's tough. Sort by largest. All right. So, which car? These Corvette, are the cars the, we have not done yet. The ones that the are in the Chevrolet blue. Corvette. Which no, one? No, no, not that one. Not that one. Okay. Come on. It's an '84. Pontiac Firebird. So, chat. Uh, 1979 Pontiac Firebird Trans Am. That's the next car. You should go for that one, chat. All right, we're going for that. All right, chat. One vial dollar. We'll sort. Ours is the smallest. That is our next car. The '79. Pontiac Firebird Trans Am. Thank you, Brutus. All right. So I will save this spreadsheet and we'll see you in the next one. In fact, I might bring you along for the whole rebuild on this one. Do a long rebuild. We haven't done that for a while. We'll see you next.